Good day mga Kabayan Techers! This is your The Kabayan Tech. Today we're doing an iPhone 10 battery replacement. Let's begin. So things that we need for us to do the repair today would be the actual phone itself that has uh, that needs the battery replacement, the battery with the adhesive, the ESD13 black stick. Uh, we have the 40mm uh, pentalobe screw head and also the Y300, the screen disassembler and also the pick. Turn off the phone if possible and always wear uh, ESD band uh, for you to protect yourself and also the phone. We're going to remove the security screws and we're going to use the screen disassembler to remove the screw uh, to remove the screen using the uh, Y triple zero we're going to remove one two three four five screws here make sure kung saan nyo po tinanggal doon nyo po ibabalik magkakaiba po ng length yung mga screws using the ESD 13 we're going to lift out the plate Using the black stick, we're going to remove the battery connector, the display and backlight connector, and also the Face ID front module. Okay, may glue po siya dito, dito sa ilalim nitong cable na to. Ang gawin nyo po, yung flat edge of your black stick, i-hold nyo po yung cable, kung nandyan. Then itong Face ID cable, hilahin nyo siya dahan-dahan. Okay, and then we're just going to lift the screen up, remove the adhesive. Meron po siyang tatlong pull tabs dito po. So tatlong pull tabs po siya na nandito. And meron po siyang uh, pull tab dito sa kabila. Uh, you have two options. Either gusto nyo po i-heat up nyo po yung likod. Or uh, tanggalin nyo po yung speaker para magkaroon kayo ng konting clearance dito to pull it up. So in my case, what I'm going to do is I'm uh, use a an ESD13. I prefer yung mas flatter edge ito po kasi dun sa pointed pero kung saan po kayo sanay. Pero make sure na naka-disconnect po ang battery ninyo uh, before you do it kasi pag gumamit kayo ng pointed na uh, tweezer baka mapuncture nyo yung uh, battery and that will uh, cause fire. So let's start uh, removing the battery on the top portion kasi meron tayong mas may clearance dito. Separate the tape using my flat edge. Then kung meron na tayong separation, we use a uh, flat edge and then we use the uh, roll and pull. So ito po isa lang ang nakahawak sa kanya pero two parts po itong battery hindi po sila naghihiwalay. So next, we remove the bottom part. After we remove the adhesives, so i-lift up lang po natin using a splodger. Remember, two parts po siya. So yung new battery po, meron po siyang guide na blue uh, para lang hindi po siya maghiwalay. So dun po sa underside niya, it's the same process that we're going to do again. Uh, when it comes to the tape. So sa tape po, ang una natin tatanggalin is yung blue part. So kung gusto nyo po, yung half side, itong half, hindi ko muna tatanggalin. Ganun pa rin ang roll, yung edge po ng uh, battery dito sa taas, uh, ilalign up mo doon sa edge ng uh, black na tape. So yung edge ng black na tape. And then, ang gagawin ko, dun sa underside, saka ko tatanggalin yung blue para pag tinanggal ko siya, hindi na ako mahirapang i-align yung, yung mga tape. So, yung taas po, i-press nyo lang. And then, yung sa baba po, ganun din. I-press nyo lang din po. Pag tinanggal ko po ito, hindi ko muna tatanggalin itong uh, plastic side na to. Ia-align ko muna yung battery ko. So, same process. Uh, I-try ko muna ang ikabit, yung battery natin. Okay? And then, saka ako siya i-align. Lightly press para mag-sit. Uh, mag and then, also on this part. Okay? And then, I'm going to remove the battery again. And then, that's the time that I lift this one up. Kung tinanggal nyo po yung adhesive, uh, lagyan nyo po siya ng bagong adhesive, then we're going to put back the uh, the phone and test it out. Okay. 
and then last would be the battery so hindi muna natin isasara yung buong phone uh, we need to test out if the battery is good so let's turn on the phone so we go on to settings and then battery and then makikita po natin 100% siya pag wala po siyang lumabas dito or hindi nyo siya ma-access dito it means that yung battery pong nilagay ninyo is hindi siya original so normally pag on nung phone may lalabas na kagad dito that unable to verify battery so yun po malalaman ninyo na hindi siya original so here it's clearly uh, charging so let me just turn off the phone again and then we're going to do the final assembly it's now time to put this one back again 5 screws po ito uh, they go on a specific order pag mali po ang nailagay yung screw you risk damaging the board so that's the reason why uh, kung saan nyo po kinuha yung screw dun nyo rin po siya ibabalik Okay, and then let's test it out. And dito po, for you to put it back, similar to the iPhone 8, uh, dito po kayo sa top portion magsisimula, uh, nakaklip po ito. So when you push it back, okay, and then uh, make sure na yung cable po sa gilid, which is this one po, uh, is neatly tucked in using a black stick. I'm going to push it down. Okay. And then, pipindot na po ako dito sa baba. That's it. Okay. So, and then the last part is we're going to put back the security screws. Okay, make sure wala pong prompt na lumalabas in respect to uh, face ID or unable to verify battery. So, we go on to battery again. Battery and it's 100%. And that's it, mga Kabayan Techers. This is your the Kabayan Tech. Uh, hit on subscribe and do the like button. Uh, hit the notification bell para at least alam ninyo kung meron tayong fresh content. So again, thank you very much and have a good day.